Whenever I see rabbits on TV or in movies, I recall the memory of that day. The day that I don't want to think of ever again. When I was in high school, I used to go to the small forest behind my village and work out whenever I was stressed by hectic studies. Even on that day, I went to the forest as I normally would do on other days. However, as soon as I arrived in the forest, I saw something before my eyes. A white object was moving around rapidly, and above the object, I saw large rabbit ears. When I looked closely, I noticed that it was the back of a huge man wearing a rabbit mask. I was surprised and felt it was creepy for some reason, so I hid and watched him. He was chasing someone, and a man in front of him was running away desperately. I was confused about what was happening, yet soon after, the rabbit man caught the man who was running away, knocked him over, and strangled him. My heart started beating rapidly. The man passed out shortly after, and the rabbit man took out a spray from his pocket and sprayed it on the man's body. Soon, his body was completely covered in orange. Then, the rabbit man shouted, Bon Appetit! And he bent down, and shortly after, I heard a sound like flesh and cartilage being ripped off, and I heard a terrible scream. It seemed that the man beneath the rabbit was struggling, and the rabbit man was eating him. I felt my heart drop about a foot, and immediately called the cops. Holding the phone with trembling hands, I explained the situation to the police, but I heard this over the phone. What? So you're saying that a person with a rabbit mask is eating another person? <laughs> that's not cannibalism, that's just playing around, you know? But after a moment, the police realized how serious the case was through a frantic scream, and they came. After a while, the police arrived and arrested the rabbit man. The man who was lying down was panting with his flesh torn off to the point where the bones were showing. The rabbit man shouted at me as he was taken over by the police. Next time, I'll eat you up. The police searched his house. It turned out that he was obsessed with eating all of his food with edible orange paint. Then he attempted to eat not only food, but also things like toys or dolls with orange paint, and it seemed that he had finally done that to a person. The man who was being eaten by him moved to the hospital urgently, yet eventually died. They said that the rabbit man was imprisoned, and when he could no longer wear a rabbit mask, he pulled his ears like a maniac and ripped them off. They have no idea why he believed he was a rabbit. However, they assume that he has gone through tremendous trauma from being abused by his parents when he was young, and he might have started believing he was a rabbit after killing the pet rabbit his parents bought. Since that day, I have been dreaming of nightmares. In my dream, my skin is orange, and he approaches me and eats up my flesh and I wake up covered in sweat. Even now, my body trembles uncontrollably when I think about it. If I could please erase this memory.